today I would like to give you some information about uh, generator cylinder head uh, roto cap. So this is called uh, roto cap. So this uh, the function of this roto cap is it turns the inlet valve or exhaust valve whenever stroke is happening. So it just turns. So the purpose of turning the valve is to have a even wear in the valve seat so that uh, the valve seat won't uh, be in one position. So the valve seat whenever it comes up and down it can turn 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 like that. Uh, it will have a equal wear in your valve seat. So maintenance, maintenance of this roto cap is uh, very very important whenever you do a cylinder head overall. So whenever you do cylinder head overall, overall this uh, roto cap ensure it is overall uh, in a correct way and uh, I will show you how to open and what are all the things that we need to check in this roto cap. Usually this roto cap is uh, locked with a snap ring. You can see a snap ring over here. So for disassembling you have to first remove the snap ring. So for removing a snap ring use a plier like and the snap ring that we need to remove first so you keep the snap ring and then this is your uh, cover and this is your cone washer you have to see the position of the washer like this and then you can see this is what you call it as uh, spring and this one is a balls so I just uh, it, it will fall down so it is always better to uh, change the balls and uh, spring whenever you do a overall of uh, rotor cap. So once we remove all this, uh, what we need to check is we have to check the inside groove. Uh. You can see the holes. Uh. This is one. This one you call it as oil groove. So this groove should be free of any kind of uh, like uh, no dirt and all. So I will clean it with some diesel oil. diesel oil this is the roto cap body so these are all the lubrication holes so this should be free of any kind of dirt just blow some air and finish it off and clean this area and check the snap ring groove there should not be any damage in the snap ring grooves and this is your uh, Coned washer, coned washer. So usually, again, uh, whenever you do an overall of this uh, roto cap, better to change the washer also. So if you don't have washer, so how you analyze whether you are uh, this washer is okay to use or not? You can see this, uh, this groove, this race, this you call it as uh, race, a uh, groove, where the ball use the ball when moving, uh, it follows this groove. So this groove should be free of any kind of damage or something it should not be worn out or something like you can see here I keep the ball like this so it keep on rotating here only so this groove should be in a good condition as I say it is always uh, whenever you do uh, a overall of a roto cap it is better to change the cone washer spring and the balls and if you don't have better check the springs just uh, check the compression is it okay or not if it is okay you can use it back if not uh, better change the new one new ring uh, spring and balls so these are all the things that you need to check so again i tell lube oil grooves check the body check the snap ring grooves check the ball and spring seat area and uh, for the cone washer you check the race 
should be free of any kind of uh, damage and again we check the inner side of the cover so again uh, clean everything with uh, diesel blow some air ensure there is no dirt nothing so then we can box it up so i will box it up again i use the same uh, old uh, spring so that uh, okay spring and uh, ball should be in this way yeah. that's all so you can see a yeah? ball and spring all six and then are all in place and then next will be your washer so this cone washer you cannot put like this yeah? it will be wrong it it don't function so you have to put always in a proper way for easy reference you just take the raise us your reference so keep it on top of it and then back the cover then back your snap ring that's all so this is how you have to dismantle inspect and assemble back your rotor cap so how to check uh, the rotor cap is functioning properly or not i'll show you in my next video but uh, i think this video must be helpful for you all so if you have any doubt in this please put in comment box definitely this video was given you some information about uh, how to overall uh, cylinder head uh, rotor cap thanks for watching thank you guys